Okay, so we're making a fall festival. I used to love going to these when I was a kid. I've already set out a few items I'm considering adding to this build. Little stalls and rides and things like that. But the main focus today is going to be the big corn maze. Now this does suck, obviously, since we don't have corn stalks in The Sims. But I had gone through the whole debug menu twice, and the closest thing will be a bamboo fence thing from Snowy Escape. So first and foremost, I'm just planning the layout of this maze. I wanted it to lead to the haunted house from high school years, because that's just like the perfect Halloween activity, of course. But I also wanted a bunch of other random items throughout the maze. Decorations, obviously, but also gameplay items and the seance table. And later, I also add a bunch of the haunted house cursed items from paranormal stuff so that your sims actually get scared more and more as they go through the maze. I put more of them clustered together as you progress towards the haunted house. So it's all just very spooky and haunted and fun. I had actually considered making this more of a haunted farm at first, or at least have a bigger pumpkin patch section, and then I scrapped that in favor of making it more like the autumnal county fair vibe that I knew as a kid. I think of that as being like peak American Halloween, if that makes sense. And I really tried to capture that as realistically as I could, which you never can because it's The Sims, but I think it gets as close as possible. So you'll be seeing a hayride, a playground area, a stage for performances, juice fizzers for making apple cider, a bunch of booths for selling baked goods and costumes, and a face painting station. I also end up having a little building on the side that's more purely Halloween rather than the general fall time aesthetic of the main building. And in that I considered putting more carnival type items or a hall of mirrors or something. But because I'm also working on a separate circus build, I decided to keep these a little bit distinct from each other. So what I end up making there is like, a trick or treat tunnel with fake doorsteps that have bowls of candy on them. Which isn't really a thing to my knowledge, but listen, our sims can't go trick or treating properly, so sometimes you just gotta figure it out yourself. I also had a sim go in and bake all the autumnal pastries they've got in game, and also make a whole lot of the apple nectar and fizzy juices, so it's all stocked and ready to go. But of course the nectar in the racks all disappear when you place it and all of the food items expire so, so fast, even though I had them made by a sim with the fresh chef trade. So, sorry about that. Please know I tried my best. Anyways, I really do hope you love the build. Please let me know what you think, and also tell me if you've ever been to a fall festival like this. Enjoy all the autumn vibes and happy simming.
somehow forgotten to record decorating this party room. Sorry about that. But here it is, looking like an off-brand spirit Halloween. I'm into it. Thank you.